you already know what time it is and what review we about to do talk fast all right so let's get into it the terminator 6 arnold schwarzenegger is back and is he better than ever or was it not so clever and start show <laughs> Let's get straight to it. Everybody's done a review on Terminator 6, aka Terminator Dark Fate. It's directed by Tim Miller. So, yeah, I got notes because that was a long movie. So, I'm gonna just get straight to it. You know, the movie, I liked it. If you go in thinking it's just a straight action movie, like just non stop action, you know, the, if you've seen all the old Terminators, you know what to expect. It ain't never been this Oscar award winning acting, but action wise, you're gonna get the action. You're gonna get all that box office explosions and I'll be back type, you know, the signature phrases. Like Arnold did his thing. He old, but he did his thing. The only thing that I thought was kind of weird is how your girl, she dealt with um, the death of her brother. Like he literally got his head blown off right in front of her. She was like, oh my God. Well, no, no, I'll take that back. Her dad got his head blown off right in front of her. She... Why do you care what happens to her? Because I was her. She's like, oh my God, what's going on? And somebody that really like sees their parents and loves their parents, they're not gonna, they're gonna literally flip their shit, emotional crying. She didn't really cry like that. She was just like in more of a like a fake shock, like, mm, that's kind of cheesy acting, you know. Mm. But then turn around, 10 minutes later, her brother gets, like impaled and he dies basically spoiler alert i don't give a damn should have seen the movie um he gets something shoved through his body or whatever so then he ends up like to end his pain and suffering the old girl was just gonna leave him there but the terminator came and just devours him and blows him up and like all in her face and so she's running for her life blah 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 long story short she doesn't even really have an emotional breakdown through the movie until like a little quick scene. She's like, <laughs> and then she wipes her tears. She's like, oh wait, my, my, my brother's dead, my father's dead. That's all I know. We don't know who the hell her mother is, but she's dead. He's dead. Everybody's dead. And she's not even crying. She's just kind of like, uh, you know. Protect the girl. Nobody else is gonna die because of me. Just half human, half cyborg. It was cool. The cyborg did his thing. She held it down for the women, gave the women power, you know, made y'all feel like, you know, rise up. I know you're scared, but I'm here to protect you. Empowerment. They've been doing that a lot with the movies, and I like it. It's cool. Ain't nothing wrong with the ladies having a little bit of power. Yeah, but it did so bad in the box office. Everybody hated it. They said it, like, killed the series, and it might not make another one. So I am just the messenger, and that's what happened with Terminator. So I don't think he'll be back. Wow. I give this movie a straight up, like, for what it was, uh, eight. Because I liked it. I mean, I liked the special effects was on point. The way his skeleton, exoskeleton liquefied and turned into another one. And he was nonstop. Like, the movie's action-packed from front to back. As soon as it comes on, it's popping. Until it goes off. So, yeah, I don't think it was an end credit scene. And if you like what you see, like, subscribe, and don't forget to uh, comment below because you might win something. You never know. Peace. If you enjoyed the content that you've seen today, like, subscribe, and don't forget to hit that notification bell for the newest and hottest videos.